ready for the warm up. All right, so for the warm up, we're gonna do a, a minute. All right, it's gonna be a minute. We're gonna do some bird dogs. All right, for the first 30 seconds, though, we're gonna do a dynamic movement. So we're gonna be moving those limbs, um, alternating limbs about every one, two seconds. But towards the, at the last 30 seconds, we're gonna hold each side for 15 seconds each. All right, so remember, bird dogs, hands under the shoulders. Knees under the hips, extend opposite arm and leg, keep that core tight. All right, for the first 30 seconds, just keep alternating. All right, for the last 30 seconds, we're gonna hold each side for 15 seconds. All right, if you do feel better switching sides, switching holes every two to three seconds, that's fine too. All right, just do whatever feels comfortable for you. Just make sure you have little to no movement in the spine, working on that uh, stability. All right. So we start with that dynamic movement, 30 seconds. Y'all ready? And go. And keep that core tight. Alternate opposite arm and leg, right? Try to have a little to no movement in the spine. Be nice and straight, right? 15 seconds, let me go hold it. Keep it up, keep it up. Nice control movement, all right? Get ready for a hold in three, two, one. All right, hold it, hold it, hold it. Just hold one side. Keep holding. All right, we got a couple seconds if we're going to switch it. Three, two, one, switch. All right, hold it there, hold it there, hold it there. Ten seconds. Remember to keep breathing. Core tight. In three, two, one, and relax. All right. Now we got that blood moving. Uh, the blood flowing a little bit. We go get that workout started. All right. So we'll kind of do what we did last week. Similar. All right. It's gonna be two exercises for each set. All right. The first exercise is going to be 45 seconds. The second exercise is going to be 40 seconds, all right? For the first set, all right, you can, if you have a dumbbell, you can grab the dumbbell for the first exercise. We got some, um, a half get up, all right? So we just go through the first portion in a Turkish get up. So to set that up, we're going to lay back. You can do one side for this round, we're going to do it again, all right? So just do one side for this round, next round we'll do the opposite side, all right? So, I'm gonna start off with my right knee up, all right? I'm gonna place that dumbbell or my, just my arm straight up, my right arm up, all right? When I get up, what you're gonna do is you're gonna lift up like a sit up, press up, you want that arm to be directed over that shoulder so you can be up on that left, that left elbow, back down, all right? So I'm gonna show you from the opposite side. So lay down, right knee up, right arm up, press up, Back down, all right? So press up to right over my right shoulder, back down, all right? After that, you can flip it over. You can get a full plank position, plank on your arm, or with your knees on the ground, all right? We're gonna extend our arms out, all right? So plank arm extensions, all right? That's all we're doing for the first round. So the first exercise, the kettlebell get-ups is 45 seconds, and then we have the plank arm extensions, for 40 seconds, all right? Everybody gets set up. Start with the get up. Everybody ready. 45 seconds. And go. And look, use that cord to lift you up. You come to the top. Put your arm directly over that shoulder, all right? And we can also do this, don't wait. Lift up, here we go. If you do feel more comfortable, you can perform sit-ups for this round, all right? Lift up, keep that core tight. Here we go, there we go, 15 seconds. Lift up, here we go. Keep working, y'all, keep working. We're getting there, a couple seconds. Three, two, one. All right, flip it over. Plank arm extensions, 45 or 40 seconds, and go. 
And just extend the arms straight out from your body. Try to have little to no movement in the spine. Try to keep that body stable, all right? If you feel like you need more stability, you can spread your legs, all right? Spread your legs a little bit. 20 seconds. Come on, keep that core tight. If you did get tired, hold that plank. That always works. 10 seconds. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. Three, two, one. All right, all right. Get your breath, get your breath. Good work, y'all. Next round, all right? First exercise, we have some toe crunches, all right? So with those, two options. First option, lift your legs up. So keep reaching for your toes, all right? Bring those shoulders off the ground. Use that core to bring you up, back down, all right? Other option, you can bend the knees, all right? Knees can be up just like this or on the ground and just reach up towards the sky, all right? So two options for that one. After that, grab that band again, all right? Place it above our knees. What we're gonna do is some side planks with abduction, all right? So you lift up to that side plank position, just open that leg, all right? Other options, you can bend the leg, all right? Keep that bottom leg on the ground, lift up this way, or if you feel more comfortable, you can uh, perform some side plank clamp shells. All right? We're going to do one side this round, then we're going to switch it. Same time, 45 seconds for the toe crunches, and 40 seconds for the side plank abductions. Y'all ready? 45 seconds. And go. Reach for that toe, all right? I think I'm gonna grab a dumbbell for this one. Yeah, I shouldn't have, but too late now. All right? Shoulders off the ground. Nice control. 20 seconds in. About 20 seconds to go, all right? Keep it up, keep it up. Ooh, that's gonna be burning. Good work, 10 seconds, 10 seconds. Push, push. Double seconds, double seconds. Three, two, one. All right. Got that side plank with that abduction. All right, also keep in mind that if you want to perform a different variation of the side plank, that works too, all right? You got 40 seconds. Ready? And go. Remember, lift up. That abduction, all right? Feel more comfortable. Maybe you can do it on your knees. All right, drop that bottom knee to the ground. All right, or you can just hold that side plank. All right, good work, good work, y'all. You got less than 20 seconds. Keep pushing, keep pushing. 10 seconds. Work, work, work. Couple seconds, couple seconds. Three, two, one. All right, all right. Get your breath, get your breath. Whew, good work, good work. All right. While I'm explaining, next couple exercises, let me get some water. All right. Next two. We're going to start off with the plank shoulder taps, all right? So remember plank position, or you can drop the knees to the ground, all right? We'll tap the opposite shoulder, all right? If you want to be a little fancy, you can add a little push-up in between if you want to, add a little challenge, all right? That would be 40 seconds. After that, for the next 45 seconds, we'll keep that band around our knee again. We got some thigh hydrant to kick back, so right? So with that one, we're gonna lift the hip up. Remember, you don't wanna twist too much. So you wanna lift the hip up without any spinal, little to no spinal movement, and then push the leg back, all right? So up, 
and back, all right? Make sure to alternate sides so you can get both sides each time. All right, everybody ready? Start with the plank shoulder taps, 40 seconds, and go. Here we go, here we go. Shake your back, core tight. Working on that shoulder stability. Good work, good work, good work. 20 seconds. Keep pushing, y'all. Keep pushing. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, Two, one, all right. Get those fire hydrants, all right. Another option, we make it a little more challenging, you can get in that bear crawl position and do the same thing, all right. Y'all ready? 40 seconds. And go. And alternate positions. Next side, good work, good work, y'all. It's a little burning. 20 seconds in, keep pushing, about 20 seconds left. Keep working, keep working. I see y'all working hard. We're almost there, 30 seconds, um, 15 seconds, side. Good work, good work, good work, good work. Couple seconds, couple seconds, three, two, one. All right, all right. Next, all right. You can leave that band around your knee if you want to. We got some bicycle crunches, all right. So on your back, you put your hands around your head to kind of protect your, support your neck, all right. So remember, use your elbow to reach for the opposite knee, all right. Nice controlled fashion. Try to keep the shoulders off the ground. All right. Get some more bleak work in. That'll be 45 seconds. After that, we have a star plank, all right? So with the star plank, your arms and legs will be wider than they usually are in a regular plank, all right? So arms wide out like a star, legs opening nice and wide like a star, all right? Hold that position. Remember other options. Go back to that regular plank. You can hold that one as well, all right? Start off with the bicycle crunch, 45 seconds. Everybody ready? And go. Remember, reach for that opposite knee, all right? Nice and controlled. Keep working, keep working. Good work, y'all. Good work. About 25 seconds left. Push, push, push. There we go. There we go. Let's do 10. Keep working. Keep working. Three, two, one. All right. Star plank, 40 seconds. Ready? And go. Move nice and wide. That plank position. A little more challenging than the regular plank, all right? We got it. Get that core tight. Just keep breathing. 20 seconds. Keep it up. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Push, push, push. Couple seconds, couple seconds. Three, two, one. All right. Relax, relax. Get your breath real quick. One more round, all right? This time, we're not going to break it up, all right? We're going to do everything, all the exercises together. 
All right. All the exercises will be 45 seconds, except for um, the get ups and the side plank leg lift, so we can get the same time for both sides. All right. So everything's 45 seconds this round, except for the side plank leg lifts and the get ups. All right. Y'all still with me? Y'all ready to finish strong? Let's do it. All right. So we start with those get ups again. And then go right to those plank arm extensions in. Work our way back down, all right? So maybe you can grab that dumbbell, do the opposite side this time. All right, everyone ready? 45 seconds. And go. And as you lift up. Use that elbow to help support yourself. Break that core tight. And press that arm directly over that shoulder. It should be a straight line. Great. Good work, good work. Keep working, y'all. Keep working. There we go, there we go. 10 seconds. Push it, push it. Couple seconds, couple seconds. Three, two, one. All right. Play guard extensions. Let's go, let's go. Y'all ready? 45 seconds. And go. Extend that opposite arm out straight in front of your body. All right. And if you need some more stability. Spread those legs a little bit farther apart, all right? Keep that core tight. Good work, good work, good work. Push it, push it. You got 15 seconds. Keep working, are we almost there? Couple seconds, three, two, one. Right, all right. Back to those side plank, oh, no, no, sorry, toe touch, toe crunches, toe crunches, all right? You got 45 seconds. You wanna grab a dumbbell, you can for this one, all right? Add some more intensity. Y'all ready? 45 seconds in three, two, one, go. Remember that option, you can bend your knees, all right, and reach your hands, fingers towards the sky. Good work, good work, good work. You got about 20 seconds, y'all, keep pushing. And we use that core to lift your body up, all right? Doing well, y'all doing well. Less than 10. Work, work, work. Couple seconds, couple seconds. Three, two, one. All right. Back to that side plank. Remember, do the opposite side, opposite side, all right? Remember, you can do any side plank variation. You do not want to do this one, all right? As long as you're working those obliques. That's all that matters, all ready? 25 seconds, and go. You might notice which side is a little bit weaker or stronger than the other one. Kind of figured this side a little bit weaker. This is already challenging. Keep working, y'all, keep working. About 20 seconds. We try to keep that leg going straight up and back. Don't let, don't let the leg drift forward. Right. Keep working. Couple seconds, y'all. Three, two, one. All right. Get back to those plank shoulder taps, shoulder taps. 45 seconds. Ready? 
And go. Good work, y'all. Good work. Good work. Keep pushing. Keep that core tight. Don't get tired. Show that plank. All right. Keep working. We get in there, we get in there. 15 seconds. Push it, push it, push it. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. All right. Got those five hydrant to kickbacks. Five hydrant to kickbacks. All right. Remember, if you want to add, make them a little more challenging, just lift those knees up into a bare crawl position. And perform it all right. Y'all ready? In three, two, one, go. Three, two, one, all right. Hey guys, Eric may have gone out. <clears throat> Are you guys there? We're gonna go ahead and finish. I think his internet went out. All right, so we were on bicycle crunches. Thumbs up, everyone can hear me? You guys good? All right, bicycle crunches, let's go on the back. We're gonna go for 45 seconds and we're gonna start in three, two, and go. 45 seconds, bicycle crunches. Let's go. Right, I'm back, y'all. I got them started on bicycle crunches, Eric. Okay, good, good, good. They just, they just started it. They're like 10 seconds in. Okay. Keep it up, y'all. Good work, good work. Thank you, Allie. You're welcome. Make sure you keep that core tight. Try to keep those shoulders off the ground. You guys are about halfway there. I'll just finish this up, Eric, for you. <laughs> keep working, y'all. Keep working. 15 seconds. Push it, push it, push it. Come on, lift up a little higher. Twist a little further. Work, work, work. Done. All right, relax, relax. All right, two more things, y'all. Let me get stretched out, all right? We got that star plank. 30, uh, 40, 45 seconds. And then we're going to do that 30-second push-up again, all right? Remember, 30-second push-up, 15 seconds down, 15 seconds up, all right? We're going to do them back to back, finish off strong. And we all done. You ready? 45 seconds. Actually, let's do this. Let's do the 30-second push-up first, and then we're going to do the star plank after, all right? Y'all ready? And go. And we're down. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, and up, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. All right? We're back to that start playing. Y'all ready? 45 seconds. Last one. Well, one minute, one minute, one minute. Y'all ready? And go. All right. 
Let's try to do one minute, y'all. Just keep in mind, I might add 30 seconds at the end towards the end. Maybe, we'll see. Just keep working, y'all. Breathe. Core tight. Y'all doing good, y'all doing good. Whew. All right, feel low, burn. 30 seconds. Push it, push it, push it. All right. Got about 40 seconds in, 45 seconds in. All right. Let's try to get the minute 15. Let's do 30 more seconds, y'all. 30 more seconds. Keep working, keep working. Push it, push it, push it. I know you want to drop to the ground, but we almost there, y'all. Keep holding. Come on, come on, come on. 10 seconds. You can do it, you can do it. Couple seconds, couple seconds, three, two, one, and relax. All right. You get in that child's pose, y'all. Get in that child's pose. Good work, good work, good work. In that child's pose position. You can hold that for about 10 more seconds. All right, then we're gonna transition to that upward dog. Drop those hips down, chest up. All right, keep all a couple seconds. All right, transition back to that um, child's pose. I can't figure out what it's called. We're gonna put our hands to the left side this time. All right. About 10 more seconds, we go switch sides. And right hand switch. Go ahead and keep holding. Couple seconds. And right, come back to the middle. Get in a half kneeling position. All right. Put our hands behind our backs. We'll squeeze those shoulder blades. Open up that chest. All right, relax. Now we're going to interlock our fingers, place them directly in front of our chest. All right. Head down, open up those shoulder blades. All right, relax, relax. Next, in that half kneeling hip flexor stretch. All right. All right, lean forward, maybe up, arms over the head, deeper stretch. Go ahead, keep going. A couple more seconds, we're gonna switch sides. All right, and switch. Same thing, so hold it, hold it, hold it. There we go, nice deep breaths. All right, relax, relax. We're gonna stay in the half net position. We'll do some inductive rock backs, all right? So we will kick out our left leg to the side of our bodies, all right? Get down to the ground just like this, and our hands in about an off, kind of in the all fours position, all right? Push those hips back, just feel a nice, good stretch. In the inductors, a couple seconds, we'll come back to the starting position. We'll do it two more times, all right? Back, hold it for a couple seconds, deep breaths. And come forward, and one more time. Take it back. And come forward, all right. Switch sides, same thing. Here we 
we go. Hold it, hold it, hold it. All right, come forward. Do it two more times. Back. Rest, come forward. And one more time. All right. And come forward. All right. Just a couple more. Now on our backs real quick. Bring both knees towards the chest. All right. Kind of loosen up the back. You can rock side to side if you need to. All right. Next, you're going to drop those legs to the ground. Get in that figure four stretch. All right, so cross that right leg of our left. Bring your legs, knee back up, the left knee back up. Nice good stretch on the outside of the right hip or left hip, whichever side you're doing first. Couple seconds. All right, switch sides. Keep holding. You know they hold it. You might relax, relax. Two more, two more. We go down our backs, bring that right knee up again, twist it to the left side, open up your arms to the right. Right. Hold it. Deep breaths. Keep that chest towards the ceiling. And switch, same thing. Keep holding, keep holding. Keep your seconds. All right, bring those legs back straight in front of you. Last one. I'm just gonna roll up, reach for the toes. All right. For the toes, hold it there, hold it there. For a couple seconds. Relax. Open up those legs. Each in between. Right. Seconds. All right. Then we're going to use our right hand to reach for our left foot. And then switch. Left hand reaches for the right. And relax. All right, y'all. I was coy. Everybody felt better.